for the second part of my argument, I'm going to do it on, I did on Peter Singer, utilitarianism. No. Humans should act in accordance with the basic principle of equality. Equality is the basic ethical principle, not in such an effect. The basic ethical principle of equality is the principle of consideration of interest. Peter Singer, strong principle states that if it is in our power to prevent something bad from happening without thereby sacrificing anything of comparable moral importance, we ought morally to do it. Without sacrificing anything of comparable moral importance, Singer means without causing, causing anything else comparable bad to happen or by doing something that is wrong in itself or failing to promote some moral good. Comparable in significance to the bad things that we can prevent. If it is within our power to prevent things that are morally wrong, such as lying and killing. Singer's principle is for one to act in a utilitarian way, one is supposed to weigh in the interests of not just themselves but the interests of others. By doing so and respecting the interests of all people affected by not doing something immoral. Humans are then characterized by their moral obligation to consider the interests of all that they affected. Through the basic ethical principle of equality, to conclude his principle states that if humans have to take into consideration of the interests of all people being affected by means of action and choose the action that something bad from happening where at the same time the consequences of this permission affects the people involved in a good way without sacrificing anything of comparable more importance. The issue is whether it is morally impossible to use capital punishment to kill a person using lethal in injection. Drugs is a medicine or other substance which has a philosophical effect when consumed or otherwise into the body. Lethal injection is a primary method of excision in the practice of injecting one or more drugs into a person. Barbiturate is a drug that acts central nervous system depressant. Anesthesia is sensitive to pain. Paralytic is the person affected by paralyzed. Paralyzed is the loss of the ability to move. Potassium solution is the metal hollow salt composed of potassium and chloride. Cardiac arrest is the rough loss of heart function in a person. Capital punishment is the legalized, authorized killing of a person as punishment for a crime. Death penalty is another name for capital punishment. Execution means to put to death. Homicide is when one human being causes another death of another. Person is an individual human being. Condemned is the person who is going to be executed. Killing is the act or action causing the death of a person. Death is the act of um, dying. Dying is the termination of life. Suffer is to experience pain. Punishment is the deliberate and authorized causing of pain or harm to a person thought to have broken the law. Capital crime is another criminal charge which is punishable by the death penalty. Death sentence is a sentence to be put to death for a capital crime. Criminal is a person who has committed a crime. Crime is an act committing violation of law where the consequences of commission by court is punishment, especially when the punishment is a serious one such as in prison. Consequences is a result of effect of an action. Conviction is a form of the correction of, that someone is guilty of a criminal offense made by the verdict of a jury or by the decision of a judge in a court of law. Guilty is the blame or responsible for specific wrongdoing. Justice is the act of being just. Justice is based on our behavior according to what is morally right and fair. Prison is a building which a person legally held as a prisoner for crimes they have committed or while awaiting trial. Death row is a place which is often a section of prison that houses prisoners awaiting execution. Unconstitutional is not in accordance with the political constitution. Morally impermissible in the meaning that the morals will not agree with it. It is morally impermissible to use capital punishment to kill a person using lethal injection. Crime using lethal um, would affect the following. Kadim, the Kadim is highly affected by this. He is the one who is going to be executed. They are the ones who committed a capital crime that sentenced them to death row and not being punished by losing the will to live. The lethal injection is used to kill the Kadim when they are in capital punishment. It contains one or more drug into a person and particularly particular and potassium solution. For instance, family of the Kadim, such as the mother, father, brother, and sister, etc. Along with the Kadim, capital punishment can have a negative effect on friends and family. They are losing someone who is due to their actions committed a crime and are nearing the last moments of their lives. They must face their punishment and can be labeled as a bad person in society. This can limit the interactions with others and tend to cause depression and regret. Friends and family of the victim. As well as the victim's family and friends can have a negative impact, the family is dealing with the loss of a loved one. Suffering and grieving should be expected the moment they learn about the death and can last depending on the individual to up to a lifetime. This health issue can limit their interactions with others and tend to cause depression. They tend to have justice served by executing the condemn, which creates more pleasure than pain. 
The physician who will be one using the lethal injection of the kadims as capital punishment should be effective when performing the procedure. These physicians are trained so they are mentally, mentally, emotionally, and physically prepared. These physicians are not killing their prejudice, but they are comforting them in the final moments of life. A physician can do nothing to change that and all that can be offered in through professional care through the final moments of life. The job of the physician is to make sure the condemned experience the least amount of pain during the process of the lethal injection, so the family and the friends of the victim can be seen as a hero. Conclusion If it's within our power to prevent something bad from happening, or about thereby sacrificing anything of comparable moral importance, we are morally to do it. According to Singer and his strong principle, it's morally impermissible for the United States to continue to use capital punishment. The lethal injections only seem to be more humane than others methods along with the being the one that produces the least amount of pain. However, the condemn still has to uh, live through pain that can take up to 5-10 minutes in the last remaining moments of their life. The death penalty will continue to be legal given that there is more pain than pleasure. The cause oh shit. No shit.